Hello everyone, my name is Equinox Doodles, and I have noticed a number of people in the YouTube comments for the workshop tutorial series noticing that when they drag their config.ini file into the actual GM edit, it doesn't load up with all of the files on the side, much like I have in the actual series. And while I did include written instructions on how to install the ROA dialect into GM edit, I'm sure many people were confused by it and would probably prefer a visual aid just like I would. So I put together this quick tutorial just so that way you can be on the same page as me and everyone else that might be following the tutorial series. So first things first, this is usually what you end up seeing when you drag and drop your config file into GM edit without the ROA dialect installed. You notice that there is no files over onto the left side, even though I said that there would be and you only get this screen. Sometimes you also might be editing a file inside of the scripts and it might say that a function is not available. That might be because of the ROA dialect being missing. That might be because of the ROA dialect either being missing or being out of date. I have included the latest version, so hopefully that works out for everyone involved. So first things first, we are going to simply Go to our workshop tutorial folder, click and copy using either control C or right click and then pressing copy. Then we're going to go back to GM edit, go to these little three bars at the top next to recent projects, click them and go to preferences. From there, you're going to scroll down to the bottom where you're going to see plugin directory GML dialects directory and reload GM edit. First things first is we're going to open up the GML directory. Simply click on the link and it should bring up a folder like this. Yours might be missing files, but if it isn't, don't worry about it. Simply paste in the ROA dialect into the actual folder. We can close this window now. And then you're gonna hit reload GM edit. From there, we're going to go back to our workshop tutorial folder for our character, take our config.ini file, and drag and drop it in. And there you go. That is how to install the ROA dialect. Sorry for those who might have been confused by my notepad version. Hopefully this visual aid is a lot more helpful for your future endeavors.